So, time for area codes. All right. Well, they already had a set of digits that were reserved for certain uh, tasks. So 411, if you type 411, that was reserved for information. Mm -hmm. You dial 411 and you'd get a human telephone book, basically. Right. What is the number of Johnny Jones, whatever, or Mary Smith in this at this address? They'd look it up and sometimes they'll dial it for you or, or they would just tell it to you and you'd write it down. All wow. Right. Okay. Yeah, this is like forever ago. All right. So 611 would be if there was something wrong with your phone and you needed repairs. Okay. Okay. So they say, we'll, we'll be by tomorrow to look at the phone line, whatever. All right. So they had a few of these that all had a, a, a one um, in the middle. Okay. However, those were established after area codes were established. Okay. Now, they knew we, we're not going to have a phone number beginning with a one nor a phone number beginning with a zero. So the highest population city, New York, they wanted that to be where the area code can be dialed the quickest because the most number of people would be dialing it. That's right. And you don't want to burden so many people with waiting around for the dial to finish dialing. That's right, because you're going with the finger thing. So with the finger have, thing. Can't have two one one, so you gotta have two one two. Two one two is the shortest time dialed area code on a dial. Yo, that's cool. Okay, so now, what city has the next highest population? Probably Los Angeles. Los Angeles. What is the area code of Los Angeles? Three, two, one, two, one, three. Three. Two, one, that, three. Low. That's why you have this. Okay. Okay. What's the next most popular city? Probably Chicago. Chicago. What's the area code of Chicago? I don't know it, but I'm sure it's 214. No, no, no. Oh. I can go lower than that. 312. Oh, 312. <laughs> that's right. Because you you're staying in the flu. You're staying you're in the staying zone. In the